Hi, this is Ushio, and welcome back to Angels with Scaly Wings. We have now seen all of the bad endings for all of the main characters, and I think we've done all of the side characters as well. So now we've just got two more good endings to go, and then the true one. I think I'm going to aim for Lorem next, because Adine, she's the one I started with, so it seems right that I end with her. So we're going to go for Lorem this time, and let's go, let's do it. Okay, so if you want to get Lorem's ending, I think you need to go to Tatsu Park and search the uh, shrubbery because if you look here I've actually gathered it already the Ixaman sphere that he's looking for is in this area so that's kind of what we're doing so you need that Ixaman sphere to get the good ending so hopefully hopefully I've got everything I need okay so on chapter 3 if you go to the police archives there's Kalinth who yeah she'll give you the files or whatever but I think what I need to do, if I go through the trash... Okay, here goes nothing. Oh, what's this? It's a flat base with a circular indent at the top. Where have I seen this before? Okay, it's an Ixaban sphere part. Okay, I got it. Yes, now I can get the good ending to what I need for Lorem's ending. Nice, nice. Skip through this. Okay, so we're on the fourth meeting with Lorem. And... He's like, yeah, that must be the sphere you found. Lorem walked up to the table and picked up the round object I found at the park. Yeah, maybe you can help me find out if it's actually Ipsum's or not. Sure, no problem. Looks like it has no battery though. He turned the sphere a few times and placed it on the base and plugged it in. Okay, you've assembled the Ipsum sphere. Actually, it was Lorem. This should be his achievement. Yes, yeah, so I got an achievement for that even though he's the one who built it. But that's that job done. He touched the base in a peculiar way. In response, writing appeared on the sphere's surface. Ooh, this is definitely new. Cool stuff. Yes, yeah, so I think hopefully I'll get the good ending now. Looks like this really is Ipsum Sphere. He'll be relieved to know that it was found. Okay, so what can we actually do with it now? Nothing really, unless you know what the password is. <laughs> well, that's a shame. I do happen to know his password, but that's only for emergencies. No play around with the sphere, got it. Okay, so hopefully, chapter 5. Fingers crossed we've done everything we need to do to get Lorem's good ending. We know what the fireworks are, we know what Rez is up to, we know all the details. Let's get to the new stuff. What's new? Okay, invite Lorem. Let's see what happens. It's time to go. Oh, I still have Ipsum's Ipsum Sphere. I should give it to Lorem when I meet them. Take the sphere. Take it. Need it. Definitely. The sooner Ipsum gets it, the better. I took the sphere and put it in one of my pockets before I headed out to meet Lorem. Okay, so this is the same as the bad ending, so we're going to skip that. I brought Ipsum Sphere. Maybe it can finally find its way home. Great. Would you mind holding on to it, though? I don't really have a bag or anything to put it in right now. That's alright. Just remind me to give it to you later. Sure. Okay, here come the fireworks. Oh yeah, we got to stop Reza. What do you think I can do? He's twice as big as I am. Let's not forget about his weapon. I can hold him off. Go get help. Okay, wait, wait, give me the sphere. Okay, take it. I watched as Lorem took the sphere from my hands and slid their fingers over its interface in a peculiar way. After a few seconds, they were done, and the sphere was back in my hands. It might not help you much, but if something goes wrong, throw it at them. Okay, where is he anyway? Underground building. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, Reza, you scumbag. You know what? I'm not having this conversation with you again. Finally, finally we say that. What are you talking about? You're playing Reza. I know all about it. I've done it like seven times or something. Great. Stop wasting time and help me with this. I'm not here to help you. This is where it ends. What is your problem? You know about the comic. We can't stay. Shut up. Not in the mood to talk to you. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I don't need to because your friend has just arrived. Suddenly, Maverick and Lorem appeared next to me. Here they are. You planned this, didn't you? Totally. <laughs> oh, out comes the gun. He pulled out a gun. Not sure which one of us he should be aiming at. Let me go, and I'll forget the whole thing ever happened. Six bullets, three people. Do you really think you can do that? Is it worth risking your life for? 
I've been risking my life every day for the last two weeks. What did you do during that time? Sip champagne in your nice apartment? Besides, the generator in the whole building came from our time. It belongs to humanity. Suddenly, the administrator came out the shadows in the hallway behind Reza. No, they belong to me. Confused, Reza spun around, aiming his gun at the newcomer, who was slowly walking toward him. Who the fuck are you? Wanna waste your bullets on me? Feel free. Can't stop everyone. Give it a try though. Bam! He pulled the trigger. Administrator fell to the ground with a dull thud that knocked her mask off. Administrator's been shot so many times she gets shot. <laughs> okay, my first instinct was to run away, but as Maverick and Lorem started charging, so did I. Maverick's on the case. Oh shit, taking them bullets. Reza was quick to aim and shot at Maverick until he went down. What? Don't shoot at Lorem! Lorem took fire with a few beats of their wings and was about to collide with Reza, but at the last moment, Reza got out of the way and hit Lorem with a well-aimed kick. Boot. Don't do that. <laughs> oh man. Lorem collided roughly with the wall and fell to the ground. Remembering Lorem's words, I took the sphere and threw it toward Reza as hard as I could. At first, it looked as though I was going to miss, but the sphere adjusted its path and flew straight toward him. Whoa, smack. Reza aimed at me, but the sphere hit him before he could pull the trigger. He lost his balance and stumbled backward before he fell to the ground. As he got up, I saw that the barrel of the gun was now bent out of shape. When he realised this, he bolted towards the exit. Bye. He tried to stop him, but he hit me in the face with the gun's blunt end and ran past me. It took a few seconds until I composed myself and ran after him. As I went up the hill, I saw that Reza was already taking his place while the portal did its starting routine. I ran up to the console, entered a few commands. Reza turned around and saw me. What are you doing? Oh shit. Reza walked off the platform, but I quickly ran around the console and threw my weight against him, just in time for the portal to start teleporting us. Where are we off to? Okay. <laughs> Lorem lived to tell the police what had transpired in the underground building. The conversation they had overheard was enough for the dragons to find out about the comet, and with the help of the portal's power source they were able to divert it. As neither humanity nor the dragons knew where Reza and I ended up, our visit was considered a failure. Humanity had decided that if our visit did not yield any results, they would no longer try their luck with the portal, and instead use their remaining energy to hold on for as long as they could. For the dragons, life went on as usual, but for our city, this outcome meant they only had to continue their fight on their own. It was an uphill battle that they eventually lost when the city ran out of resources and fell. Oh wow. That was the good ending for Lorem. The bad ending for humanity. All dead. Oh my god. Okay. So next time we're going to try for Adeen's good ending. It's the last good ending to go. So hopefully I'll see you then. And this is Ushio signing off. And yeah, hopefully I'll see you next time. Okay, what now? Me and Reza, we reappeared on the other side and collapsed to the ground. It was the day of my arrival in the Dragon's World, just as I had planned. What the fuck's going on? <laughs> oh, look what the cat dragged in. You're supposed to be dead, am I now? You're right, but today is not the day. Oh, she held up Reza's head and punched him. His body instantly went limp as he fell unconscious. Good job. Oh, is that yours? She pointed at an object on the ground behind me. When I turned around, I realised that it was the Ixaman Sphere. Whatever setting Lorem activated had apparently prompted it to follow us, even through the portal. Uh, not exactly. Uh, you better hold on to it regardless, those things are expensive. She walked over to Reza's lower half and started lifting him by the legs. Come on, help me with this. We've got a long night ahead of us. Okay, gotta get things ready for the next time we do the playthrough. Lorem's good ending, yay.